Hey everyone, this is Ruveen and in today's video, we will talk about how we can register ourselves for low code era components. Uh, low code era components are the ready to use and configurable component which you can use for your Canvas app. And we already had two sessions for season two and first part of the season three where we checked like how based we can use the low code era component for our Canvas app. So we received a lots of question related how we can get started with it. If you are a developer, if you want to try the component, how one can uh, sign up and how easy it is to install that in your um, in your environment. We will talk about that thing in detail in today's session. And to present that, I have a Rahan uh, who is a founder of Locodera. He will just showcase us the easiest step to configuring that in our environment. Hey Rahan, how are you? Hey Dravin, I'm good. How's it going? You all right? Yes, I'm all good. I'm all good. Uh, so we had lots of questions Rahan, related sign up process for low code era. And many people have questioned that does it free for developer? What's the thing? And let's say I want to use the component uh, for my practices and I just want to create some use cases. How can I uh, get started? And uh, I think like the right person to answer that Rahan himself. So that's how uh, I invited you. So thank you so much for coming and uh, showing our audience like how we can get started with low code era. So yeah, uh, the floor is yours. Go ahead and tell us how someone who is very new who can get started with this. Fantastic. Well, look, the good news is if it wasn't easy enough before, well, it's just got even easier to process now because um, we made a huge, um, we hit a huge milestone um, at the back end of last year where we got certified um, on App Source. So our components became um, probably, we're, we're the leading library of Canvas components um, globally. And Microsoft, we're delighted to um, announce that our components are now available on App Source directly, which means pretty much through a single click, you can get our component library deployed directly into your Dataverse um, environment. And I think that's that's a huge deal, especially for our enterprise customers. Um, you can still, of course, go to the Locodera website and, and sign up for a trial and a dev uh, subscription through there. And that's quick as well. Um, but I think um, having uh, our um, solution on AppSource uh, makes a lot of people happy. Um, and uh, we'll just um, show folks, I guess, how how to get over there because App Source is quite vast. So you can you can head over to AppSource.com, um, and you will see this is a, a universe of um, partner solutions um, from partners across the globe. And so, um, if you haven't checked out app source before definitely go on to it there's tons of of stuff on there you can simply search for uh, locodera or head over to the power app section we're quite well featured there and just like any other app store um, you essentially uh, click on uh, get it now um, if for some reason um, you're having uh, difficulty remembering how to get onto app source and uh, um, you're on. You just so happen to be on the Locodera website. You can scroll down, and in our footer, we've got a nice uh, hyperlink which takes you straight into the the listing which we have on AppSource. Um, and if you're new to Locodera, don't know about it, what's really nice about the AppSource listing is that we again provide a few uh, bits of information, including some some videos which will tell you all about what Locodera actually is. Um, it's um, completely free to, to do this. Um, you essentially click on the get it now button. Um, just a caveat on this, you, for, of course, for you to be able to deploy the solution into your environment, you do need certain levels of privileges. Namely, this is gonna go into your database environment. So you need to be an environment admin to be able to uh, deploy solutions into. Um, so you simply click on this button and um, ultimately you'll be taken through a sign in process um, to to if you already signed in, then then good enough. Um, but essentially you'll be asked to to select 
your target environment that you want to deploy this to um, and you just hit OK. <laughs> and um, as Dhruvin said, uh, a short while later, um, you'll have the solution in, in your environment. Now, you should also receive an automated email um, soon after that, which will invite you to, to register to the local ERA admin portal, because that's the place where you get access to additional resources, such as templates, um, links to our support, um, and um, license keys should you want to develop um, the apps into, into production. Um, but it's a pretty seamless process, um, and we're thrilled now to be part of AppSource. Um, all of our components are, are accredited and trusted, um, so you can depend on AppSource. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's great. So once those components are installed, so let's say I click on the install button. After that, it takes around 10 to 15 minutes to install that component in your uh, in your environment, whichever environment you have selected. So let's say I select a default environment or let's say if you have a dedicated production or development environment, just select that appropriate environment for yourself. So, uh, so that uh, that solution packages are available under that environment. So Rahan, after uh, the installation process is completed, uh, can you just show us like uh, which are the packages the user can see under their solution? And if everything's gone well, you should see two entries from Locodera in and amongst the other solutions which you might have. So I'm just going to filter on Publisher. You will see we have a a couple here, Locodera UI and Locodera data visualization are the ones that you would expect to be imported in um, from, from AppSource. So it's as simple as that. Yeah, and it is absolutely very simple. Okay, so my next question is like, let's say this package is that installed successfully. Now let's say I want to use into Canvas app. So is it something like I need to enter any key or like will it work uh, directly as soon as I open that component in Canvas app? Right, so the next step is uh, create your app. Um, so we're just obviously not gonna create a whole app, but what I'd like to do is just quickly uh, demonstrate how to get going. Um, so um, we're creating a new Canvas app here. There's one more key step which um, you need to follow to make sure the components are usable in your app. Um, so essentially, First and foremost, you won't see uh, the components uh, listed here on the left hand side for you to use until you at least get one. And the first one which um, you should get is something we call our low code era UI assets components. So I've just clicked on um, get more components into the code tab and searched for UI. And at this point, this is, if you like, our master component for Locodera, which uh, allows all of the other components to, to work. And I'm just going to add another Locodera component, maybe a simple uh, button component. And if we add that to the canvas, it will say no valid access token controls for authentication. So there's a level of uh, licensing and protection which we have on our components. And you essentially need to paste in a, a license key or an app token, as we like to call it, into this UI assets component. And upon doing that, you will be able to use our components in this specific app. So the question is, where do you get that token from? So um, as part of uh, the invite link, which you would have got after AppSource, you'd have got a link to the Locodera admin portal. That's app.locodera.com. And once you're signed into there, you'll come to a screen which looks like this. As I mentioned, this is also a place where you can see uh, some of our other apps and downloads and other bits of content which are going to be useful. But in this case, all you want to do is head over to app tokens and what you want to do is click on this button here in the top right called get dev token and that copies uh, the the token into your clipboard you come back to your app you select the ui assets component and 
as soon as you've pasted that in, you can see that component is now unlocked. You only need to do this once per app um, to unlock any low-code error components that you're using. So in simple steps, all you've got to do is uh, add the UI assets control to your uh, app, head over to app.lowcoderror.com and generate um, a dev token. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's easy. And uh, one question I have that uh, as a developer, I enroll myself to this program. So how many dev tokens I can generate? Like, is there any limit? No, absolutely no limit. So we're quite generous. We allow you to have access to all of our components, all of the functionality, um, generate as many um, development apps as you want. The only limitation will be is that your apps as a developer will only run in App Studio. Um, so for you to take an app into production where users can run it in play mode, this is where you need to generate what we call a um, an app token, not a dev token. And those app tokens are only available if you've purchased a commercial subscription to Locodera. So you can build and test out as many apps as you want in App Studio. There's no limitation there. It's only at the point where you want to have users using an app in play mode, um, do you need to have an app token available. Mm -hmm. That's really great. So uh, any everyone who is very new, the steps are very simple. Just install it from your app source. After that, uh, just open app.locodera.com, which you have received as a link in the email after you install that. And after that, you just need to open that portal, add a UI asset component on the app. That is the first step and enter this license key and you are all set. After that, you can add any component from the Locodera library and use that for your different use cases. So yeah, that's it. Uh, anything else, Rahan, you want to add here? No, I think it's uh, pretty straightforward and the process is now a lot more assured and easier with our integration on, on AppSource. So we're, we're pretty delighted about that. Okay, that sounds good. Hope that answers everyone's question to how to get started with their journey as a low-codera uh, low era components. So the process is simple, enroll and sign up yourself and just try this component. And also, if you have any question, feel free to share your question in the comment section or directly connect Rahan on his LinkedIn. All the links are available in the description box. Also, the different use cases, uh, different type of sample apps, you will get all the access through the low code era website. Uh, that is also available as a part of the description box. And always check their documentation and don't forget to update your component library frequently because they are constantly releasing the uh, uh, different stuff to the app source as well. So make yourself updated and just use this component and uh, make your power apps more beautiful and create the next generation of power apps. Thank you so much, everyone. And thank you so much, Rahan, for showing us this whole process with our audience. I think uh, now they are able to uh, use this product and try the different components which are available as a part of this package. Great stuff. No, really pleased to be able to share that information with your viewers today. Thank you for having me. Thanks a lot.